Right, this is a test of a voltage regulator rectifier on a Royal Enfield Himalayan uh, because the battery keeps discharging. I've set the multimeter to diode test. I have the black lead from the multimeter attached to the red lead coming out of the reg rectifier. And then I use the red lead to put on each of the pins for the AC going into the reg rectifier. That's the normal setting I'd see, 0.5 a volt or thereabouts. What I didn't expect was when I connect the leads in reverse. So I have the red lead from the multimeter going to the red lead from the voltage regulator and the black lead from the multimeter onto the AC inputs into the reg rectifier. I'm getting a reading, which is why it discharges back through the generator. So the voltage from the battery is going back through the voltage regulator down into the generator, basically turning it into a heater. Um, just to compare, I have here on the floor a Japanese regulator rectifier. So I put the red lead onto the red lead into the reg rectifier and the black lead will go on to the leads, the three AC inputs. So they're all open line, which is what I expect to see. And then if I reverse them, so the black lead from the multimeter is going on to the reds that go into the reg rectifier and the red from the multimeter goes on to the three ACs which in this case are, are yellows and yet again if you look at the multimeter exactly the same reading as what I'd expect going that way. So on the end field they've either got a capacitor fitted inside or we've got leaky diodes.